Well, my last power is fire. Who knew? <laughs> oh, yeah. I like this one. <sighs> Let's see those things in action. I'm on it. Melt that one, too. Fortune smiles upon us this day, my friends. We just almost got crushed by a giant meteor. There you go. Almost. I knew something will be behind He's one of these. Alright, oh, this is better. I am so jealous right now, Quill. You should be. What is that? Come on, Rocket. We got past your fear of water. That ain't water. Ugh. Well, does it burn? It, it's so gloopy. I can't jump. It's like this magic mud stuff I used to make as a kid. There is nothing magical about mud. You haven't been to the spa in Contraxia. I have not. You don't really strike me as the spa type. Like I said, magic. How do we get across this gunk? Perhaps we can leap to the ledge above. I wouldn't hold your breath. Oh, of course not. Steady breathing is essential to an effective leap. Step aside, mortals, and allow the Meltinator to do his mighty work. That's a terrible name. Huh? Got a better one? PD Hot Guns. No! Captain Fireball. It's not even a fireball. It's more like a uh, heat glove. Captain Heat Glove. Nope. No. <laughs> How did I miss that? I swear, Quill, you get all the fun toys. What? What about that weird gun you have that turns people inside out? Oh yeah, the zipper. Man, I gotta fix that thing. <laughs> I gotta fix that thing. Can you give me another ride, Groot? Oh, come on, what? Here's good. would work back there they've saved us three times already i mean how did you know they'd melt that ice wall Guard oh, on the war uh, lord I... i have oh social lord this is warlord okay so we could have just as easily died horribly yep <laughs> Flark, it might be his name. Maybe he's trying to communicate. Please don't. I am Groot. Yeah, not sure we want to piss this thing off. But if the beast is hunting us, it will not find us easy prey. Assuming there's only one. In harsh environments like this, creatures tend to hunt in packs. We are a pack of our own. Yeah, and what a pack we are. Yep, we are a great pack. What? I meant it in a nice way. Check out these pointy trees. Don't check them out too closely. Groot says watch out for those plants with all the holes on top. I don't want to find out what these are, so I'm just going to burn them. With all these exceptional beasts, it's a wonder Lady Hellbender does not move from home. Burn, baby, burn! <laughs> nice! I ain't ever gonna get tired of that. Groot says those plants deserve it. I 
the right way. Uh, we'll check this way out. Hey, two, one, uh, uh, really close together? Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> Oh uh, shit. Just say less, bro. Oh. Yeah, it hurts. Root says they've got corrosive spores. Maybe don't get too close. <laughs> Captain Heatglove. Is that my new captain name? Maclu 4 is beautiful. It's own twisted way. The trees are indeed twisted. Well observed. Fruit says the plants here are all mean or stupid. Oh, we got a thousand already. Yeah. Your new best bud. Run! I'd say communication has failed. Another affair. Where go? Ah! Oh, plasma shots damage over time. Okay. Snow monkeys. Wendigo. Is that really what we're calling them? Hey, they're the ones who keep yelling Wendigo. Wendigo. See? So that we haven't seen the last of them. But can now there's any more secrets around you here. Say Fin Fang Foom is a foe, unlike any one could imagine. I mean, he's basically a dragon from the fairy tales on Earth. Ridiculous. This is not some Terran tale of fairies. Maybe Hellbender <laughs> will want to add some of those Wendigo to her army. Assuming they don't hold a grudge. Wendigo! Wendigo! Much for not holding a grudge! Quit trying to make friends and run, well! The first time they're ever in front of me. They still just tried to communicate. Heads up! They just hurt us into their zoo. Look for them. The dinner plate. Let's make sure we don't end up on the menu. Can we kill any faster? What? It's a breathing room, bro. That thing was freaking nasty. Come 
reminds me of our guys. Let's talk, Hold guys. Up. Let's talk. Victory will soon be ours, my friends. I love, I love Rapid's outfit now. If they do, we'll have the to move group. like lightning. <laughs> Hit them from behind. But what if they're too fast? We'll need another plan. Hey, hey, hey! Every battle comes with some kind of curveball. But trying to predict where it's gonna land only makes things worse. Relax. It's easy to overthink when things get tense, but if we focus... We can hit him hard. Who's with me? Let's do this! Feel it! You gotta love the quietness like after every talk. Came out to play. Let him run! I got bombs for all! I thought you'd never This battle ask. was satisfactory! Can we kill any faster? It's black cold! Understood! I shall kill with haste! Move it! Ha! Murderize you! Stick it to a group! <laughs> yes! Bring me more! Uh oh! Hey! It's that Jack Mark who was hucking rocks at us! Oh shit! Crap, he fucking Can we runs. Kill any faster? It's black cold. This is not the battle. Yeah. <laughs> this reminds me of our monster hunt in the prohibited area. Let's hope it doesn't end the same as that one. You guys get a load of that wreck, Chip? See? I'm not the only one who can land in this weather. Second wave. Direct second. combat is far more honorable. Branch out, dude! Yes! Bring me more! No one takes joy in their work like you, Drax! There you go. Everyone even have a chance? No? Lamar didn't get a chance. We killed their leader. They should leave us alone now. Or seek revenge. I think that, that wreck is the camp. Camp we saw. Uh, this thing has been here for ages. Look, the smoke's coming from the other side of it. We're close, but we're gonna need to get up there. All right, Groot, give me a boost. About yay high. Yay is not a unit of measurement. Groot knows what he means. All right, heads up. I'm gonna drop something down for you guys. Look out below! Ha! Battle work. You think those creatures were using this ship for shelter? They're dead. <laughs> I am cold. I'm fine, just itchy. Here, give me a hand. We should be ready. We don't know the source of that smoke. More hostiles. It's just a nice warm fire and some cigar and spirits. No doubt it's something that'll try to kill us. This place is like a fun house of razor blades. Great speech. But I'm not worried. We face meteors, poison zit cats, and abominable snowmen. When to go? Right. And we beat them all. I'd back this team against anything, including Fin Fang Foom. 
Whatever it is, it smells... Bodies. It smells of bodies. Jeez. Is all this foom? Undoubtedly. Damn. Can I, like... Jesus. Up ahead. Looks like there's a survivor. Who goes there? No head. She has no head. I believe that repulsive tentacle orb is her head. And I can hear you with it. Are you the only survivor? Clearly not. Who are you, Meat Sacks? We're here for foam. Forget what I said. Yeah, I'm the only survivor. Or will be. I take it you know where we can find him? Sure. Digesting my men back at his roost. Big Eyes Obelisk sticking out of the Caldera's frozen sea. Don't worry, we'll take care of Foom. Sure you will, Terran. Just don't come running back How here. How does everyone know he's a Terran? You. We still got some things to pack up. Are you gonna be okay? I don't need your pity, Terran. I'll head back to Contraxia and lick my wounds. Ooh, hey. You may not want to do that. Contraxia isn't exactly safe right now. <laughs> when is it ever? Seriously, maybe you should just come with us. I've been embarrassed enough today without taking help from a stranger. I can look after myself. Well, if you hear people talking about a promise with a matriarch, just steer clear. I'll keep that in mind. Sorry about your men. Eh, dead men collect no paychecks. Speaking of, aren't you the Mad Titan's daughter? What of it? Relax, I'm not looking for trouble. There was a time I'd have taken you in for the bounty. There was a time I'd have killed you for trying. <laughs> yeah, seems we've both got bigger problems right now. Seems <laughs> like. Um, any of you corpses mind if I help myself to your stuff? No? Well, thank you. May as well put it to good use, right? They ain't using it. Alright, what's that? One to the thousand. There we go. Extra health. Wait, that's only one, right? Oh, wait, uh, Cooper Dodge is a thousand. But I, I, I like health. Got you covered. Nice. Nah, Here's stink. hoping we do better against Foom than this lot. Another hunt marker? This one is unclaimed. No doubt it belonged to one of these corpses. Guess they never got the chance to plan it. I've appropriated it for our own use. To herald our bravery this day, shall mark our ultimate conquest, or our glorious defeat. Foom may be bad news, but he's nothing compared to the fight that comes next. And shall mark our penultimate conquest. One conquest at a time. Big ice thingy on the frozen sea, eh? I agree. You said it, buddy. Sure is a long way down. Let's go. All right, people. Let's catch us a dragon. Yes. We grow ever closer to our great destiny. You're awful, Chipper, considering Foom obliterated that camp like it was nothing. We are not nothing. I'm with Drax. No mountain too high, no valley too low. Literally. In the case of this place. <laughs> This is amplifying our velocity! This is how I die! Ah! <laughs> Have you lost your fortune mind? Come on! If you look at it as incredibly dangerous, it's actually kind of fun! 
Getting down part. I don't even want to think about how we're gonna get back up. Or how we're gonna get Foom up there. Look on the bright side. We may be dead. Back on Earth, people would use dog sleds. A whole line of huskies pulling a sled across the ice. Don't expect me to be the dog. <laughs> I was actually thinking of the Wendigo, and Foom is the sled. That's the craziest idea I've ever heard. Yeah. I love it. Ooh, I didn't think it could get any colder. You know, it's days like these. I'm glad I installed seat warmers in the Milano. Up ahead, there's the ice obelisk. This must be it, the frozen sea. This is Damn, the look how far spot. down here. Here we will challenge the great beast. Fin Fang Foom, come and face your death. What are you doing? We can't get the drop on him if he knows we're here. Also, we're not killing him, remember? Shout with me. Here we demonstrate our metal. Fin Fang Foom, your end draws near. Nope, not his end. Your quill, go. Uh, uh, fin Fang Foom, it's nap time. Oh, Rocket, it's your turn. Did he just say my real name? Rocket. Fin Fang Foom, we're gonna decomboggle your flock at scut spigots. You hear me? He hears you. You scaly, overgrown gordel splode. You fessed lump of sitarki and shrub meat. You don't scare us. It feels good, does it not? Yeah. Yeah. It actually does. No, we disrobe. Yeah, we're not doing that. <laughs> Prepare yourself, Fin Fang Foom. You face your final moments. Not final. Just through here. Be ready for anything. That is technically impossible. Here we go. Impossible. Foom was born without fear. You don't know that. In the cold heart of a dying star. A dying stars ain't cold. This one was. You think his lair's behind that? <laughs> this one was. Let's find out. Oh. Rage 
brains down! Guys, I should have talked before when we dropped him. Man, yes, celebrate this moment, my friends. Victory shall soon be ours. We shall carve our name in the history books, Peter Quill, and it will not be spelled incorrectly. Look, I know we want to celebrate because we're maybe two steps away from winning this fight, but if we start dancing with before we actually win, these scut holes will send us to our graves. So let's keep our focus and show these losers exactly how we rock. Who's with me? Victory is ours! Bring it on! Let me in! Hit him down, Groot! Lock and load, Rock! Hope this makes us square with Hellbender! You would do well to use her full title in her presence! There we go. I'm getting cold. Then you are not fighting hard enough, Rocket. These are on a baby too. I can't believe we're fighting a dragon. It is a truly momentous battle. I can't believe we're fighting a dragon! What's wrong, Peter? <laughs> Do not hold back now! Who's been holding back? Move away, Rocket! Most 
very desperate, very desperate right now. We are ready! No! Fire! Hell yeah, bro. Big Bang Boom defeated! Yes! We stand triumphant! Boom has fallen! Oh, hello. We screwed up. We conned you, robbed you, killed your baby. We can't take back what we've done, but we want to make it right. Uh, Quill. Murdered the Dragon Lord of Kakarandara! Two of us together. Lord Foom. The final harvest begins. Dead worlds screaming across space. We must go. Now. Someone needs to take a stand against the church. I could really use some help. You pay one debt, then create another? No, though I can kind of see... Enough. I will gather my forces. All right, let's go. Hell yeah. Let's go. Let's go kill this bitch. I mean, kill, save my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> 